What's up, family? It was around 1998 when Hollywood dropped this movie called Fallen. It was about a square, straight, you know, not corrupted, honest cop detective who caught a lot of people and was good at his work. And he was only more, uh, what is that, used to uh, physical contact until he came across a demon, evil spirit named Azazel. Azazel was uh, a being or spirit, evil spirit who could hop around from body to body and could stir up trouble whenever it so pleased. Now, it's crazy because I've dealt with something like this. And I seen this movie and it kind of made me like, I don't want to say like scared or nothing, but I mean, all right, you know what? Yeah, I, I admit that. Because when I saw this movie, this movie was on point. But the thing I'm trying to say is the the Bible was right, man. It's not ourselves that we fight against. It's demons, man. It's spirits of these these principalities, these malevolent beings, these uh, multi-dimensional beings that we fight and face every single day. And I call them body hoppers because it be the ones, the people with the weaker will and the ones that don't believe in nothing that be the easiest to possess. And you wonder why you be by yourself and you mind your own business. Someone comes along or either slap you, punch you, give you a, a, a quick shoulder bump and act like it ain't nothing. You know, you never know. And then it be that rule, you know, that commandment, thou shalt not kill. And you shouldn't kill. Because you never know, man. You could be killing an innocent person and you got like this demon spirit that be on you. And that's this is what's happened to me before. I understand this movie so much. Like, I was bothered by somebody who I did not know. I've never met before in my life. But this person came out the blue and just stuck with me for a good month. And no matter where I went in the city, that person would pop up and be there and just push my button some kind of way. This was a long time ago. And I was like, I'm running into this person everywhere I go. And it's not the person, it's the spirit that inhabits the vessel. It's that being that just travels. And you know it too. You see it. You always see it though. It be right in front of you and it give you the same look. It's always the same look. I swear on my life, bro. This is like one of them things that's hard to contend with. You can t contend with, you know, your street gangs, your street hustles and whatnot. And you, you know, you just easy to look for somebody that got an image. Look for somebody that got that face. Look for somebody that be wearing this and that. You in the streets and you looking for somebody, right? And it's easy to try to catch that person. But one of the, the most hard things to contend with, man, is a fucking demon evil spirit. I swear to my life it is. The government won't talk about none of this. The schools won't talk about none of this. That how you have random people come out of nowhere. How you, why do you think that some of y'all get hit like burglarized and... It's not even, you, you ain't doing nothing. You ain't stirring up trouble. You ain't got no enemies. You got burglarized. For what? So the troublemakers, man. It's the fallen, the demons. Whether they're spirits or demons, man. Evil spirits, man. These, whatever the fuck they is. Body hoppers, I call them. I've always seen shit like this. And I had that same look on my face like, Damn. How do, how you 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 really know me? I never met you before, and you 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 push me. You know what it is, and I never knew who it was or what it was. Didn't ask the name, man. I just prayed my ass off. That look on my face, like damn. It can be anybody. It can be anybody. And that's why thou shalt not kill, man. You know you got that person that that's bothering you. You know what I'm saying? If you don't feel this 
this kind of energy or this like unworld i don't know what i'm saying otherworldly force that's within this person man if you if you do feel this otherworldly force man just leave it alone man just don't 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 mess with it leave it alone and if you see that the uh person that you are having a problem with if that person does not have that feel that energy of anything other otherworldly man go ahead and throw them hands but other than that man yo there's there's uh some kind of being or spirit or whatever the hell is hopping around stirring up trouble and i call them body body hoppers i don't know if it's one i don't know if it's a whole bunch of them but like they say in this movie fallen 1998 azazel the demon evil spirit and then like denzel washington's movies are always playing on tv I think and believe what well, I really believe, man, Fallen is one of the movies that Hollywood would not play on TV. And this is why I know why. They will play any other Denzel Washington movie, any other one, Deja Vu, Training Day, Man on Fire, The Preacher's Wife. They'll play any of those other ones. But Fallen is the one that they will not play much of. But y'all out there, man, I know, man, it's hard, man. The hardest thing I, I had, had came into contact with, with is just trying not to kill that person. But it, And it's hard, man. This is just one of the hardest things. And it's not the person, man. It's the the uh, evil spirit that inhabits that person that just comes out the blue. And the ones that come out the blue is the ones that are not of this world, man, like body hoppers. This this fallen nineteen ninety eight man check the movie out. Your boy Baruch Shah. The Heavenly Father is always the truth. Peace.